Miami Dolphins took their second loss in as many weeks as they fell to the Buffalo Bills by a score of 41-14. My name is Brandon Howard with Sports Talk Florida, and this is your post-game three and out. The Miami Dolphins were unable to achieve any sort of offensive continuity throughout the game as Ryan Tannehill struggled to allow plays to unfold, and even when he had time to throw, he was too eager to take the check down on occasion, so hopefully that's something he can get a little better with. Uh, in addition to that, they had difficulty establishing any sort of run game. They didn't get movement in the run game. All week long, they talked about pad level and uh, getting a little bit uh, lower you know, and driving defenders back. Uh, that, frankly, didn't happen throughout this game. And also, Ryan Tannehill um, was unable to pre-snap diagnose where the extra man was coming from, where the blitzer was coming from. Uh, the Buffalo Bills did an outstanding job of disguising some of their their blitzes and you know where the extra blitzer was coming from. So um, that that definitely uh, gave the Dolphins some issues. Uh, in addition to that, uh, you had the the Dolphins' defensive line. They had to do a better job of getting pressure on Tyrod Taylor, and uh, that did not happen. He was able to get outside on the perimeter make plays, uh, extend plays, and that puts a lot of stress on your defensive backs. That makes them have to cover a lot longer, and uh, they were able to make plays as a result down the field. So that's something that they've got to tighten up and hopefully begin to get more pressure with that front four. Um, as far as the defensive backs are concerned, uh, those guys played entirely too far off of wide receivers. So that allowed them to catch a lot of the underneath routes, your hooks, your curls, your drags, things of that nature. And, um, you know, they made a lot of plays that way. Uh, throughout the duration of the game, a lot of the underneath stuff was wide open, and uh, that's something that they're going to have to clamp down on. So uh, hopefully that'll be a focus uh, going forward. Uh, we'll definitely talk to Philbin about it throughout the week and uh, see where they go from there. They've got a tough challenge uh, in London against the Jets, and hopefully they can get better from that point on. My name is Brandon Howard with Sports Talk Florida, and that concludes your post-game three and out.